Hi, my name is Raymond Bakari. I'm from Providence, Rhode Island. I had entered the C-SPAN Student Camp Contest in the years 2019 and 2020 with uh, two close friends of mine, Aiden Santos and Giovanni Jimenez. Both of those documentaries that we had uh, submitted placed second place in the Eastern Division for the contest. Our uh, first documentary focused on the Second Amendment, how it's upheld in society and the issue of gun violence in the United States. The year after, we focused on the Electoral College since it was uh, the prompt of what issue we want the presidential candidates to focus on. And uh, we as first time voters felt that we should talk about the Electoral College and if every vote counts equally under the system. Since entering the contest, I am studying media communication at Rhode Island College. I am also editor-in-chief of our uh, student-run newspaper on campus called The Anchor and general manager of uh, Anchor TV, our uh, school AV club slash TV station. And I am applying a lot of the skills I learned from the student camp contest to what I'm doing currently uh, on campus at Rick and I am just very grateful for entering the student camp contest when I did because at the time I was uh, in my junior year at high school, I knew I had interests in politics and media and film and video, just wasn't sure, and current events, I just wasn't sure how to um, put it all together, but this uh, contest gave me that experience to put all those interests uh, to good use and it resulted in two awesome short documentaries that uh, allowed me the honor and privilege to interview candidates running for office at the time and elected officials in office at the time. Uh, it was just all a great experience and I would do it again. And um, I just recommend also being objective and getting multiple perspectives uh, on the topic that you're choosing and also in the people that you're interviewing. It doesn't have to always be politicians either. It could be a judge, a historian, a legal scholar. Uh, in my documentary, it was a lot of politicians and candidates, but and we'll judge us too. Um, but we also made sure that we had gotten conservative voices, liberal voices, libertarians, moderates, progressives. We had it all, and that's uh, critical in creating an objective uh, dialogue. And um, lastly, just have fun and enjoy every bit of the experience. You never know, it might end up leading you to what you want to do in the years that follow and what you study at college or if you're going into high school, maybe you might want to join a student paper in your high school. You never know. Um, I also, uh, one last uh, bit of the story, um, I host a political interview show on my YouTube channel called Reality TV. It's an uh, uh, interview show slash uh, podcast. I interview current uh, elected officials and those who are seeking office in my state and uh, I just am very grateful for the opportunities that the student camp contest had opened for me and it all started with C-SPAN and um, if you're entering this uh, year's contest I wish you the best of luck and um, just remember have fun and always uh, enter each year you have eligibility it's a great opportunity great experience to put on your uh, resume as you're applying to college and you get some money out of it but the money aside, the experience is uh, worth way more than um, than than anything. Um, yeah, have fun.